Hi, my name is Shelby Freitag. I graduated from U of A in 2017 with a bachelor's degree in agricultural technology management and education with a te teaching emphasis. Um, I chose the U of A because of the career path that I wanted to go down. The University of Arizona has a phenomenal ag ed program that I'm thankful that I was a part of. Um, one way to become an agricultural educator is the traditional route with a bachelor's degree um, that I took at U of A. So um, U of A did become my first choice when I decided to become an ag educator. Um, so what challenges did you experience in college? Um, I I didn't really have a whole lot of challenges. The, the biggest thing I think is just uh, maintaining the momentum that you have when you're first at U of A or when you first go to college and you know the classes are tough it can be a little bit um, different than what you're used to so keeping the motivation to um, get through those little hard classes the little struggles um, I think is probably the biggest struggle that most students have it's one that I had and um, I think that once you decide to just power through it and kind of keep up that momentum you can start um, seeing the light at the end of the tunnel, maybe, and know that once you get that much closer to your career, you're better off. So I work at um, Antelope Union High School. This is my fourth year teaching in Yuma County. I'm currently their agri-educator, FFA advisor. Um, I taught for two years at Gila Ridge, and now I'm doing my second year at Antelope Union High School. So I currently have the job at Antelope Union. Um, the reason that I got that job was because I luckily, right around the time that my old FFA advisor wanted to retire, um, that position became open and I kind of figured my way out to get out there. Um, I love the Antelope Union FFA chapter. And so being able to give back to that um, community and that school was really important to me. Um, so I'm really happy that I'm currently teaching at Antelope Union High School. My favorite experience at U of A was just getting to spend time with people that were also in the College of Ag, um, getting to do industry tours with Sigma Alpha, take classes with all my friends that were also in the College of Ag, that just, you know, very like-minded people that are very interested in the agricultural industry just like I was. Um, um, my favorite classes were probably anything that you could take with Dr. Franklin or on the farm at the greenhouse. All of those really hands-on classes were probably my favorite classes to experience. So I chose the U of A because it was close to my hometown. I live in Yuma, Arizona, um, and it offered the best opportunity for an ag educator um, major in Arizona. The campus and everything just felt a lot like home. Uh, the people felt felt like home. It just it was the right place for me to be once I figured out that that's what I wanted to do was become an agricultural educator. So my biggest advice that I would give to students now is to get involved in everything that you possibly can. Join the clubs, um, take on every leadership role you can, get involved, embrace every network opportunity that you have. Um, you're never going to regret taking opportunities or taking that leap of faith it's probably going to be more of you regretting not taking advantage of those activities while they were put in front of you. So I would say soak up every second of your education, getting to take um, classes with your friends, get every hands-on experience you can, um, and don't be afraid to take on things that put you out of your comfort zone. So just, just get involved is probably my biggest advice.